And what's good y'all, this your boy Fresh hitting y'all with some of that Black Ops 2 domination on the map Yemen and this is gameplay by my boy Killer Kevo and when I say Kevo go get him, he says don't trip Fresh, I got him and this is a 113 kill game with only 9 deaths meaning he is in the grocery store right now in the meat section throwing all the meats in the basket because he is a predator and these noobs are falling prey to his msmc so his link will be in the description make sure you check him out he does post comms live comms he's a pretty cool dude and i've known him for a minute so he's like family now i've been noticing lately that a lot of our teens out here have been fucking up not all of them, but a good sizable amount. And I don't know who to blame. Do we blame the parents for letting iPhones and computers and all this technology be babysitters and parents to our kids? Or do we just blame our kids for making retarded ass decisions? I'm not sure where the line should be drawn. But for me, I just been noticing it a lot lately. We see it on Twitter, we see it on Facebook, and especially YouTube, all these retarded ass challenges. And a lot of these kids just have no fear for imminent danger. They have no self preservation or awareness when it comes to things that might potentially kill them or respect for authority. And for me, it makes me sad because these are the future leaders of our country. These are the people that will eventually make decisions for us. And that troubles me because a lot of these kids come from good homes. They don't come from fucked up backgrounds like me and a lot of my friends. Yo, we struggled, we had to grind, we were poor, we didn't have money, so we had to go out there and get it. These kids got iPhones, Jordans, I was wearing Kmart clothes, my dude. I didn't have all the things that these kids have now. And the parents buy them because they use all of these materialistic things to substitute for being parents i don't get it i don't get it and it drives me crazy so let me know what you guys think about that hit me up in the comment section below and before i go i'll tell you a little story last night i went to the 7-eleven and on my way i watched two about 17 year old kids fight yo going at it and the winner stomped out the loser and halfway through the fight a lady called the cops she was in her car watching of course and when the cops got there and these are police officers that are pretty cool dudes i had run-ins with these guys when i was a teenager and all they ever wanted to do was just be a part of the community and help but it's crazy because the team that won he just went straight to Pac and all these dudes were trying to do was figure out what happened and try to help so what happened dude got tased and now he's on the ground flip flopping on the ground like a fucking fish out of water all for nothing and that's what makes me sad about our teens out here so let me know what you guys think about our teens today hit me up in the comment section below and this is your boy fresh and i'm out peace